we're excited to show you about our sauces today. We've got four different sauces that we use on a regular basis, and we're going to touch a little bit about each one. And each of these sauces cover absolutely all the sauces when you mix them up properly. Um, they'll Any sauce in the world that you want is part of these beasts. We'll start with our, our first few, and then we'll talk about a little bit about both of our favorites. So the first one is a chicken gravy, which is great to have with your chicken. And the next one is the Espanol sauce. And this one is really nice um, for roast beef and dinner. Beef gravy. Beef gravy. Good. And the next sauce is the bechamel sauce. This one here is a creamy white sauce, a cheesy one for fettuccine, uh, linguine, all of those. Um, this is a great sauce for that. And oh, you have ideas. I do have an idea. What I, I love this sauce and this is one of my favorites. And what I do with it is I saute a little bit of uh, garlic um, and butter. And then I create a little bit of a roux. And then I add my water and then I add the sauce. So it actually gives that little bit of a punch that we need in our sauce to really, and it's the garlic and the butter flavor. You add Parmesan cheese to that mixture you just said, that's your Alfredo sauce. Or you can add like mushrooms and it's like a mushroom soup. Instead of your cream of mushroom soup, you could do that. Or broccoli or cream of exactly. everything. Just whatever you add to it. And this is an, an amazing sauce. So I love it. Sweet. This one is my favorite. This is the tomato sauce. So our tomato sauce is really versatile. Now I'm going to show you and we're going to make a little thing with it. This is lightly seasoned. Now you can do it so you just have straight tomato powder with no other ingredients. We do have that ingredient. But this is our tomato sauce that has light seasonings into it. So I'm just going to take a little scoop. You add the amount you want, but it goes a long way and you don't need much. Now, I'm going to um, add a little bit of hot water, just like this. Now, you can change your consistency. Okay, I'll just, I'll, I'll yeah, that's, and you can change your consistency, depends on how much water you add to it. So a little, sure, a little bit of water, you get a tomato paste. A little bit more, you'll get a tomato sauce. And a little bit more, you'll have a tomato soup. And I actually use this for pizza sauce. As you can see, the consistency is thinning a little bit more as we go. And I add a little bit of oregano to it, and then I'll use that as a pizza sauce. And I will use that for so many things. I will take the sauce, grab my ground beef, onions, peppers, throw it all together on my stove, and I have my spaghetti sauce done faster than cooking my spaghetti noodles. So you can see that consistency. Oh, I got a taste. Mm. Oh, that's so good. It is. And it's and all so has, easy. All the seasonings already in it, so you, it takes the thinking out of it. So this is one of my favorites. And just remember, we have four different. Oh, we'll put that down. Okay. <laughs> I think they've seen enough. That's so good. <laughs> Tomato sauce. So we have our four different sauces. Pick and play with the ones you want, and remember to share, like, and follow. follow.